Is it working? I really hope it's working. Please. This laptop is on its last legs. <laughs> anyway, guys. Uh, we're in good luck because... What? We're in luck because it's working. The camera's working. This laptop is dead. It's on its last legs, I'm telling you. Um, it's what you get when you buy a laptop from Argos. Speaking of... Argos it is Christmas time and well nobody's using Argos anymore are they it's more of a Amazon thing this year isn't it literally you can't go out and buy presents well you can but it's not wise to let's just say that um, and yeah Merry Christmas and yes it's five days till Christmas and it might be my last video for a while for Christmas um, or until the next year the new year until 2021 we shall see but anyway i'm going to roll the intro as always it's just a little update guys nothing special well special things have happened um in the last month or so but here i am yet again welcome back to the channel and like i said roll the intro like this i am too modest you know? but i do believe in myself there's just nothing like a frosty bottle of coca-cola and yeah guys there may be background noise because my brother's home today as well uh, it's the Saturday the Saturday before Christmas 19th of December yeah welcome back guys I've been so slow up on the videos just because I've been enjoying my December in whatever way I can really uh, playing a lot of Fortnite probably uh, more than I care to admit but I've been doing that a lot this year it's one of those years um, but yeah um, good news I'm famous I'm more famous than I already was from that newspaper article I was invited on like a webinar uh, whatever the definition of that is basically like I was interviewed by like it's basically the so in, in, in England we've got the um, the WFA Wheelchair Football Association uh, for the sport I play Powerchair Football if you don't already know where have you been um, anyway Powerchair Football is becoming a sport in Italy now and the essentially the Italian Powerchair Football FA or whatever you want to call them but it's called Fit Pass I think uh, it doesn't translate in English directly. Uh, the F Italian Federation of Pagia Football, basically. Anyway, they invited me on this webinar to speak on behalf of football in the UK in some ways. And because of my Italian heritage, I could understand what they were saying about me. And no, it was just like good to be part of an upcoming sport in another country. Italy, of all places. Um which is important to me and that's why I was probably invited on but I want to thank EPFA for that as well being the Europe, this is like UEFA of Padgett Football like the European FA of Padgett Football basically um, and they invited, they got me connected with these people in Italy um, other players and people involved in the development of Padgett Football in Italy um, so I got to talk to them explain a bit about my story how I started, you know, things like that. And a few weeks before that, I featured on, well, a few weeks before that, I made a, a video clip for the Ep for News channel, or News, Ep for News, whatever they call it, which is there on their website and their YouTube channel, where they just interview players from around the world. And I was interviewed for that, essentially. Well, I made a video and sent it in, and it went on there, and I was very proud of that. I got a lot of comments um, from players who saw it. Um, and even, of course, the the webinar with the Italian FA went really well. I had a lot of views. All my family in Italy managed to watch it. And the amount of comments was just ridiculous. Everyone just going mad about me being on this thing. If I wasn't already famous from being in the paper, you know. It's just great. All these things come at once. It's brilliant. I'm going to try and have some sort of Christmas... Though you only allowed like three families in your house. 
and we've got a few relatives coming over from Italy uh, to be with us, so them and a few of my cousins, um, and it's all good, really. It's all looking good. It's all falling into place, despite the outside world falling apart. In this household, it's good. It's all good. And I know it's not been easy this year for any household, especially this one, but um, you see where where everyone's struggled this year and what everyone's been through and it's well done to have made it this far. I don't mean that in like a go at people who, who suffered with COVID or anything or lost because of COVID. I mean like in general, if you made it this far, well done. If you're unscathed, that's not true. Everyone got a few scrapes and bumps and bruises throughout this year. If COVID, if you didn't catch COVID, it affected you in some way, mentally or your freedom or, you know, like me, my freedom in some ways affected that a lot. Your, your confidence of normal life, that your understanding of normal life for anyone, it took away that for a lot of people. And it's been difficult, but here we are five days till Christmas. I've got as many presents as I could get. Um, and yeah, um, it's different because for the first time in ages, we didn't even buy a real Christmas tree. If you saw last time, it is very nice. And I'm grateful we've got a tree and a roof and all these things. Uh, something that you come to value more this year because of those people who don't have that. They've suffered a lot this year. And yeah, you can't, you can't, it's hard to enjoy Christmas without feeling guilty for other families who might not be able to enjoy it at all. Um, but here we are. And you've got to make the most of the moments, you know. Yeah, you've been through bad things, but don't just act like that's all that ma like that's all that happened. You know? Don't act like you won a battle this year. If you got COVID and you beat it, congrats, you know. Whether this vaccine causes us to grow third arms or legs or whatever, who knows? Um, I don't know. Maybe it's probably good. I don't know. Don't take my advice, but a lot of people will be taking it. I probably will too. Um, if I'm allowed to, I'll see what my specialist doctors actually say. Um, depending on the other medication I take, or the drugs I take. I'm a druggie, guys. Uh, I've taken. It's taken this long to admit it. <laughs> no, but yeah. So we'll see. Um, and, and the future is bright. I'm not going to jinx the new year. I'm not going to do that. A lot of people probably will at some point, because everyone did that last year. We're like, oh, this year was shit. Next year's going to be even better. Goodbye to anyone who ever said that, you know, like, no, that wasn't the case. It just went downhill, literally. The minute we said Happy New Year, it just went downhill. Every year, I'm like, I knew it, like, something's going to happen. It's too good to be true. And all the riots that have happened, some for better, uh, some of the violence for worse, in some ways, uh, the destruction of so much, so many people's like livelihoods in America and in here for different uh, political reasons. Trump is out of office, thank God. But is Biden any better? Probably not. I've said it before and I'll say it again. But I'm not here to talk politics all day. Um, so I'm going to get some lunch, then just play Fortnite all day. But I'll see you guys real soon. If not in the new year, I don't know, I might make a vlog in the meantime. And then upload it at some point. But I'm going to be drinking. I'm going to be celebrating. And God, I'm going to be eating a lot. So I might come back just gaining a few pounds. I've been gained a few pounds, you know. We'll see, guys. But I want to wish you all Merry Christmas. Um, you know, try to make the most of it. Don't think about tomorrow or the past. Think about the now. You know, don't think about next year yet. Obviously, we want to live better lives next year. But that's next year. Let's try and make the end of this year better than the rest of it. Because by God, has it been shit. But here we are, guys. I'm getting texts left, right and centre. People asking me to play Fortnite. Typical, innit? Because I'm so good at the game. I'm so brilliant at the game that they need me to carry the team, you see. Or so I say. Is that really true? No. They're all carrying me, that's for sure. Anyway, guys, take it easy. I'm your boy, Louise21. Always chatting. 
the real talk, you know what I'm saying? Does that even make sense? I don't know, words are just coming out of my mouth, but my brain's not telling me what to say. So that's enough of me talking. Have a lovely holiday, happy holidays, and I'll see you real soon. So anyway, guys, peace! Thank you for watching, and good night.